We generally don't operate on children until they're five to six years old because that's when their ears are close to adult size. But there is one key difference. If a child is born with an ear abnormality, uh, other than the ear being absent or partially absent, we can treat them with a new device called ear wells. Okay? What ear wells do is allow us to mold the ear. So it used to be that we would wait until the child got old enough to get surgery, but we can oftentimes alleviate the need for having surgery in the future and treat them at a very young age. And that's the key. We have to treat them when they're very young. I want to see these kids as soon as I possibly can, a week old, two weeks old. Once we get beyond six weeks, the level of circulating maternal estrogens, which allows the cartilage to be manipulated, uh, has decreased and we may not be able to successfully treat after that point. So if your child or you have a family member who has a newborn has abnormality in years, we need to see them right away. The thinking used to be that, hey, they'll grow out of it, they'll get better on its own. Well, that's just factually not true. It really doesn't happen for a lot of large majority of these cases. This does not involve surgery. It's putting on a device that's held in place with basically tape. Uh, it stays on there for about two weeks, and then we may have to put another one on uh, when we take the when we take the original one off. But it works exceedingly well. And the main thing is you get correction in the vast majority of ear deformities in a newborn, and they won't have to have surgery in the future. So if if this is something that um, that one of your family members has, they have to call us right away because, again, time is of the essence and we can do this without surgery.